Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another vlog here in beautiful Canada. And today we've got some stuff planned. Uh, we've got the dock we gotta go throw in. We're gonna be doing that real soon once Silva gets back. He was, he's out getting me gas right now for the Elgin so he can actually run it. Um, other than that, Sam and I, we might run the hydroplane today. It really depends on weather conditions, but it looks like it will probably be a good day. Uh, I might get some sailing lessons in today, you know. We got a few things planned, so also we want to go kayaking. We got some stuff, so stay tuned, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, so Sam has gotten a great idea to tie the two kayaks together and float them out on this, which is the dock, float them under it, float it around to over here where we got to set up the dock, and from there we can put on the wood pieces. So. I think it's a pretty good idea. I think it may work. So I guess we'll just have to wait and see. All right, they're they're rowing out. Why is there a wrench on a rope? That's. <laughs> we have a wrench on a rope. See, the funny thing is, we can just walk out to it. It's like right over here. Yeah, I could I could walk out to that. I don't know. Don't know what's compelling them to row. All right, before I get him, we're gonna see if this plan works. I mean, he's trying to wrap the wrench around the end of that, which is down there, and then that leads the whole pipe leads up to that hose. So. All right, it's off the ground. Okay. Let's just see if it. Let's see if it all drifts. Well, you gotta pick up. It's working. I don't see it moving down here. Yeah. So it will move. All right, we got it moved. Uh, unfortunately, that didn't come without sacrifice. <laughs> they they didn't have to get in, but uh, I hopped in and he moved it over. But it's four feet over now, about enough to fit this dock in. So we're gonna do that now. And hopefully the kayak plan works. <laughs> I'll be damned, it worked. Um, it's on, at least. We could just put the deck on and just make it a deck for Honestly, we could, pontoon. <laughs> <laughs> then we just don't, we won't have kayaks anymore, but you know, we got a pontoon then. But yeah, we're gonna see if we can get this out there. It looks like we most likely should be able to now. It's literally gotta go out around the rocks over to here where we just moved the hose. All right, this is ingenuity at its finest. Just made a freaking pontoon boat. All right, well, the dock's set in place now. It's just a matter of getting these kayaks back over here, so. Silva's rowing him back and we'll bring him back up here. All right, so this is the dock. It's all set up. See, as you can see with me standing on it, it's not falling in. I need to grab that and pour out at some point. But we got the kayaks hooked up over here on the dock. And yeah, it works. Everything works. The only problem was we lost one of the caps. It's like down, yeah, way down there. <laughs> we'll have to get that at some point. But I think we're gonna do now is Sam and I are gonna go sailing over there so I'm gonna grab my GoPro and yeah bring you guys along. Is that the uh, green one? What? Yeah, got one. You gotta get in. Yeah. Oh, Lordy. You're on? Yeah, I'm on. Okay, sit down. Actually, on this side? No, sit, sit up by the mast. We're gonna pull this thing out eventually. No. Oh, that stays in? All right, that's a key. Right, lean, lean, lean the boat. Lean, get the mass over. There you go. There goes Silver with the Elgin. Oh, oh Lord. I can't paddle hard enough to keep it. We're, hit, we're gonna hit you, 
Barrel. We just decided to really pick up. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be nice. You paddle a little bit, and I'll steer the rudder. Rock, 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 rock. I'm trying to, but your boat's in there. All right, come on, you ready? Go. Nice. You need the sail. forward. Can you push off the back of the rock, sir, back there? Got it. We're good. done. done. Does this have to get in some somewhere? Young Sylvie. Sail carefully. It's not a day for an experience. I'm sorry. Yeah, but now I'm learning this way. I'll know how to do it with calmer winds. Who's this one? The sin. Watch it, watch it, watch it. We're gonna pick up here too. <laughs> Alright. There's the Elgin out there. Okay. So I want you to sit up there. Move, move up, because this rope is gonna be this is our important rope. Oh yeah, Elgin's moving good. how we move the sail with the wind. Make sure this mask is good. Okay, swim over and I want you to. Yeah. Okay. I got the keel. I have the keel. Yep. I mean, it looks pretty right. 
It's stuck in there. What? I'm gonna come over. All right. I gotta get this thing over. Actually, no, wait, I'm gonna, hold on. You push from that side. We have someone coming towards us. <laughs> yep, I got the keel. I pushed on the keel and. Right, get back on. <laughs> oh. All right. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. Good. <laughs> that was kind of fun. I just went right. <laughs> well, yes, we fell in. I didn't have the GoPro rolling when it happened, but. We hit a really big wind. <laughs> Nothing sunk right, we didn't lose the paddle. Okay. All right, back to sailing. <laughs> the myth of the legend, Silva, he probably did see us go in. <laughs> sure. <laughs> At least we got one run yet, or we got your more 28 too. Wavy. Well, we went in. <laughs> well, I was gonna get on. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna get on. All right, let me give you my life jacket. We're doing a little bit of a switchy switch here. So I was gonna get on, and I'm gonna drive my Elgin. See how easy this is. To oh my God! The <laughs> Dear Lord! <laughs> A little switch there. Silva's out there now. I got my Elgin. And the handle's falling off again. God, this handle sucks. Well, yeah, I'm gonna run this. A little smoky. I forgot how small this boat was. That turn was very in. Eh. And all the water slots is. This boat cannot take sharp turns. I'm playing a bit of chicken right now. Everything looks like it's working pretty well now, though. Luckily. National drag race now. Neck to neck. Really free area. I had to go full RPMs the whole way, but I've beaten the sailboaters over there. They, they even come the full way. There goes the engine. They even come the full way. Oh, it's so peaceful out here, though. Look at this. This is just beautiful. This is, that's the government dock over there. That's where we'll be launching the hydroplane, if we do. But, yep, yeah, that's the lake. Fun little adventure with the Elgin. All right, so I'm back now from my Elgin trip. But more importantly, look at this thing. We pulled this out from a tree. It was literally, look at this back here. It was literally in the tree. There's a chain. That chain won't be getting used anymore, but we got it out, and it's a sunfish sailboat. So, you know what? Pretty good. Alright, as you can see, Sam has taken the suncraft. It's a one-person boat, so we'll see. We can't go out with him. He has to go on his own. And this is the first time it's been in water in probably like 25 years, Silva says. So it's going out, dirt and all. And we'll see if he comes back. Right now he's just struggling to get wind. Alright, Sam claims he's not sinking and he's moving now, so. Yeah, I do too. I'm just not that experienced with sailing yet. 
I don't think I could make it. All right, so we know for a fact this is good. This, uh, whoa, those are some big waves. Uh, that sailboat, because all three of us rode it, none of us sunk, so yeah. Pretty cool that we got it off the tree. All right, so as you can see back there, we got the hydroplane, and we're en route to the dock, uh, or the launch ramp, which is just a bit down the road. So we're gonna take it down there and launch it, and I think we're gonna take it back to the cabin then and keep it there for a bit. Yep. All right, so this is the ramp, and yeah, that's sketchy right there. <laughs> it's a big drop. So the ramp's here, cabin's down there, so Sam's just gotta drive it over there. He doesn't have a paddle, um, hopefully he doesn't get stranded. Alrighty, so what's going out, Sam's in. Well that ended up working pretty well. There we go. Ooh. First pull. There we go. That's a running Mark 28 right there. It's pumping. I know it's pumping good. All right, so there goes Sam. Now Silver and I will go back and we'll meet him back at the house. I'm in the Elgin boat while Sam's out on his hydroplane. I got you away from these rocks because I'm going to drift. Alright, that should be good. There's a string. Now let's hope this thing actually fires up. Because it almost left me stranded down at the government dock. Operate anymore on this boat, that's not good. Kinda just have to chill here now. So I was trying to get the sailboat out. Sam's gonna give me a turn on the hydroplane, but I gotta get into the dock with this boat first. Because apparently this boat's not needed. But the Elgin, she's running pretty good. I'm happy about that. Looks like Silva's pretty much out. He's got definitely some wind to get him going, so I'm gonna get the hydro start back up again. She's been sitting for a bit now, so this will probably take a few. down a bit since he's still not out of the dock. He does have a bit of a cough, I've noticed that. But I'm going in. Come on, Silver, get out. Might be doing another loop with Sam. Alright, as of now, conditions are way too bad for the hydroplane, so we just got parked up over here. Sam's going to try to sail some more because of the wind, but... Um, yeah, we're gonna go eat dinner in a bit, see how the conditions are after that, and if they're any better, you know, we'll throw the hydroplane out. If not, we'll put it back in the car and we'll save it for another episode of the vlog. Alright, so we just did the insane. Silva, what did we do? I don't know what we did. Alright, you forget. We towed both the, um, the sailboats with my Elgin, my little two horsepower Elgin. I, I, she really held up pretty well doing it. Uh, she cut out a couple of times, but for the most part, she was doing pretty good. But yeah, both those things plus Sam and Silva, uh, I'm pretty proud right now. You know, she did pretty good. Uh, we'll see. We'll see tomorrow how she still handles <laughs> whether that messes up or not. But now Sam's out on the hydroplane. Uh, you can probably hear him out there. We're trying to see. We're going to try to get some runs in before the sun goes down because this water got really calm. Silva. About to, about to do its first spin on the hydroplane. That's a loon, right? Mm -hmm. I just heard a loon. He's into it now. He's gone. Is that considered planing at that point? Okay. Yeah, once the boat flattens out. Ah, okay. Oh, there he goes. 
Now he's really pushing it. I hope he doesn't turn. Yeah. It really doesn't feel good when you turn. I was, I oh, was I like bet. wiggling back and forth and I was sliding. <laughs> oh, I'll 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 I I'll bet. Show you that. Oh, hard to play in time. Does it feel good? Warm. Did Andrew want to run into water? Okay, so basically, so you see how it's in here, Joel? Yeah. Alright, so when it's time, when you want to go, you're going to press that, you're going to turn it this way. Now, that, like that? In, there's a trolling lever, okay? That, so yeah. When you're coming in, it's going to feel like as you get close to neutral, the engine's going to stall. So what you have to do is you have to push that back to start. Which because is this way, or? Yeah, when you push show. back to start. So okay. further back. So oh, this ahead. back, okay. So it's, so actually what I'll have you do is when, like, you know, do a loop or, you know, whatever, I mean, whatever you want to do. Uh-huh. And then come by here, and I want to practice, like, I want you to practice it. Cause yeah. Actually, yeah, let's just check the fuel. It should be good enough. Yeah, I see it in there. How much? I don't know. Half the tank? Yeah, probably about that. Then it is open. Alright. Basically, um, put it here and then press the button, just turn it slow. No, no, that's reverse. Oh, uh, okay. Put it here, slowly. There you go. Give it a little bit more. And then bump this. No, no, don't do anything yet. fishermen to let it out.
Ah. I ain't get neutral right. I ain't get neutral right. <laughs> There's neutral. Alright. Might be able to float in. That is fun. <laughs> Yeah, we'll go get it up there. Well, guys, that was the hydroplane. Hey, look at that, Aaron. Look up. What's up? Oh, yeah, that is just beautiful, that sky. This made for a really good video. But, yeah, that's the hydroplane. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, we might have some more content with this. Uh, I'm not sure yet. It was really fun. Uh, we'll probably have it out again at least another time while we're here. <sighs> Trying to see if I can scoot up here. Alright guys, so that's day two in the books. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, we did some hydroplaning, a lot of sailing. Um, so yeah, uh, make sure to stay tuned for the next can of vlogs. And if you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye <laughs>